And it, this picture, is, I remember, um, uh, was really strong, and it was in the moment of uh, the Syrian um, uh, war, and it was the, the beginning of the exodus uh, from Syrian uh, population um, to Turkey, mm -hmm. and then later on um, to Europe and around the world, uh, uh, but also in the Middle East, because it's also um, refugees in Lebanon. And so, um, and, you know, I was looking at what's going on in the world, you know, we were following the news and, and I had these things in my mind about photography and about how can we articulate, you know, and how can we work on a project to, to bring some, to bring this body of work on refugees to show the public and create a narrative around. So it was the first idea. And I remember thinking then um, maybe the work of Sustu Naral was uh, certainly great, but in that very strong period, because it was a very strong period, very, very hard period for millions of people um, in that time uh, from Syria. The idea is about um, uh, curating an exhibition, um, having also different activities around the exhibition so we can attract more public. Um, our goal is to get more public to see the work, to look mm -hmm. at the work from the photographers and to also uh, be in the platform, interactive platforms, start to think then, you know, why not to do it on the 20th of June? And so I was working to um, look at, um, uh, to create a new, uh, new platform. Um, and uh, yeah, and then after we find this platform online, um, I had this idea to, okay, so let's, let's do it virtually, but let's create around this exhibition uh, on the same note uh, that Exodus is about, um, interactivity, um, having interview with photographers, and then very quick, actually, I thought that it was a fantastic opportunity. First week um, of the exhibition, we had set more than 7,100 um, uh, visitors. Mm. 7,100 visitors. Uh, in the exhibition uh, virtually. Yeah. We had live interview to uh, 13 um, uh, photographers, journalists, um, uh, speaker of um, the house, thinking of United UN in New York, uh, UN in Turkey, UN in Thailand. We had European um, uh, Migration Department in, Euro in the European um, Council from Strasbourg. So amazing. It was in three languages. It was in English, Spanish, and Turkish. Um, we had, yeah, so the attendance for the interviews, by the way, we had more than 1,300 people uh, who attend in total uh, all the interviews, and we had more than 30 press articles. So, wow, you know, um, yeah. so again, I think, you know, um, here, is something then, of course, in real, we will also have results and we will also have a report. You see, I didn't change anything from what we used to do before with Exodus Deja Vu. I'm waiting for the vaccine. I was going to say, um, maybe our vaccine for now is, is to be creative, to be uh, in yeah. a vaccine, to be, yeah, exactly. uh, but to be human, to support each other, to, to, be, um, to be really like this, what these photographers were all, you know, uh, most of them, they're all legend in, in, the, in this industry as a photographers and photojournalists and, you know, uh, they're writers as well. And uh, it shows then, then when people are really getting together, when they decide together to support, like never before, media as a role to play uh, and play about the images that they are showing. Uh, journalist also has a role about what they write, um, about how they, you know, um, express themselves. Photographer has also a role, like they always had a role, a role of witness, um, they witness. And um, um, yes, um, I think, uh, unfortunate, I mean, unfortunately or fortunately, I don't know if it's, I think it's, it's unfortunate to get used of uh, looking as um, photography um, about the refugees, about war, about, you know, getting use of um, um, uh, images who are shocking and emotionally um, also disturbing.